terrifying moments turned tragic Wednesday after a man opened fire at an office building in Orange, California, about 30 miles south of Los Angeles, killing four people, including a child. Upon arrival, the officers discovered um, shots that were actively being fired entering the business. And in the area, they have discovered four victims that are deceased on the location. Video recorded soon afterward show what appeared to be an assault style rifle apparently dropped on the street. Police have not revealed the names or ages of any of the victims or the name of the shooter, but say he was taken to a local hospital. Residents nearby say they were shocked by the sound of gunfire as authorities asked them to take cover. And I was going out to dinner with my wife and uh, I just heard about five to seven gunshots and one of the officers told me to get back into the parking structure and uh, I parked my truck and uh, I just I saw like five officers running down. I heard other gunshots, so I stood behind the wall. And Overnight, California Governor Gavin Newsom tweeting, horrifying and heartbreaking. Our hearts are with the families impacted by this terrible tragedy tonight. Wednesday's incident is the third shooting in recent weeks, marking a deadly end to a month consumed by a series of high-profile tragedies at a grocery store in Boulder, Colorado, March 22nd, and a string of killings at spas in the Atlanta area on March 16th. And it is the deadliest mass shooting in the city of Orange since the 1997 shooting at the Caltrans maintenance yard that left four workers and a gunman dead. This morning, another quiet community shattered by gun violence as police search for answers. I've lived there all my life, so it's not, this is not to be known, you know, so uh, it's kind of scary. It's a very tragic incident, and um, we're doing our very best to make sure that it's investigated thoroughly, and we'll give you as much information as we can. Yeah, I guess the question, Steve, is why? So are authorities any closer to figuring out the motive there? Yeah, how it's still very early in this investigation. One of the first things they still needed to do is determine a timeline, nailing down a sequence of events of what happened, where and when. In a scene they say is about two floors of that office complex and the courtyard, all, of course, under investigation.